the real meaningful co-production, what it does, it really, really enables everyone to feel that it's they have ownership and they have some stake and some investment in what decisions need to be made or what piece of work that needs to be carried out or what service needs to be designed. So it um, it it removes a lot of wastage because from the onset, you are informing and involving, engaging people and asking them what would work and what wouldn't work. Increases productivity because, you know, people come with creative ideas, creative ways of doing things. It also allows you from the onset to know that each and everyone who is involved with co-production has a role and has a different perspective. And particularly when you're looking at things from equality, diversity, and inclusion, a lot of times I'm fantastic in terms of ensuring that services are culturally sensitive, are inclusive, uh, people who are not there. I try to represent underrepresented voices. Mm. 